this video I'm going to show you how we can use a Android emulator to download data I've previously stored on my Google Drive. You can see here the file has been created and saved on my PC via Google Drive. I'm opening up that same file I downloaded. And now I'll use the virtual survey tool and um, do some post processing on the PC using an Android emulator called Numu. There's actually a, a video for that um, in the previous video on our channel you can have a look at that but here you can see i've just opened up the visual survey function and i'm clicking on a task that i saved previously now you will notice that um, there are images loaded but it hasn't been processed yet so even though i zoom in i can't really locate points yet i have to press the local process button at the bottom now, I fast forwarded this process a little bit. You'll see the seconds just jumps a bit here and there. Um, but basically, it takes about two minutes to process, and then I can start picking out points. So uh, I need to find the points in the picture, and you can actually use multiple points in different pictures that has that same uh, reference point on the image. It will just make your uh, point a little bit stronger and it will average out more positions the more points you pick on different images uh, let's just save that there and maybe give it a name that's the corner of the building i'm now i'm going to just find another point maybe let's take something a little bit higher on the roof there that's a suitable position and maybe pick it on one or two more um, images now the images are stereo um, mapped so that's what gives us the um, position on these images and each image also has a real-time RTK position from the CHC nav GPS in this case I used a i93 and then when you're ready you, know, you just click save obviously give it a code uh, this was the top of the building And then uh, we can have a look at the points that were created. So these points are now calculated based on uh, the positioning of the camera at that time. And they should be 2 to 5 centimeter accurate um, using the 5 megapixel camera on the actual receiver. So this is how we can process data from uh, Landstar in the office on the PC using Android emulator. And this is just one example of the many functions available in Landstar.